I was just about right? to say the same thing. <laughs> Maybe in April. You know, April's a little different. You may yeah, want to March take off. Yeah, March and April. But... south-ish, but uh, right now it's beautiful. <laughs> right now, yeah, we're seeing that mild sunshine kind of mixed in throughout the day today, similar to what we've seen earlier this week as well. And we'll look at increasing sunshine as we head towards the end of this work week and the weekend as well, taking a live look outside right now in East Providence, seeing those peaks of blue mixed in there, although we are looking at more widespread cloud cover today. And that's keeping things a little bit cooler at this hour. We're still in the low 60s across most of the area, 63 right now in Providence, down towards the coast. We're at 66 right now in Newport. So we'll look at continued dry weather. There is a chance for some showers on Saturday, but that'll lead way to uh, increasing sunshine, especially by the second half of the day, Saturday into Sunday. So kind of just a minor blip in the road there, otherwise looking dry. We're also looking at a stretch of milder temps ahead as we head towards the end of the week, Thursday and especially on Friday. And again, the weekend overall looking good right now outside of that chance for a shower or two on Saturday. So let's take a look at that temperature trend here again. We'll be looking a lot milder as we head towards the end of the work week and the start of the weekend. So good time to get outside and enjoy some of that fall weather here. Satellite and radar quiet conditions across our immediate area. We do have a cold front to our west, but this is expected to kind of dissipate and uh, retract back into Canada here, keeping things dry in southern New England. Let's take a look at the tropics here. Hurricane Kirk has now uh, continued to strengthen with maximum winds of 85 miles an hour. This storm will continue to strengthen into a major hurricane or is expected to towards the end of the week. Luckily, though, this is staying out in the open ocean not expecting any impacts here locally. Let's take a look back on a local scale as we head on right on throughout the day. Today on Wednesday, you can see this cold front kind of starts to break apart here, so we're not expecting any precipitation from that. That's going to lead way on Thursday for a beautiful day. Again, those milder temperatures as well by the afternoon. That trend will continue right on through Friday as high pressure continues to remain dominant across our area. The only changes we'll see again is mainly Saturday morning, early Saturday morning into maybe early afternoon we could see a couple showers but only a minor blip rest of the day Saturday does look okay as of right now your forecast for tonight overnight lows slightly cooler with those partly to mostly cloudy conditions but skies are staying dry with that your forecast for tomorrow on Thursday looking at more sunshine which will welcome those milder afternoon high temperatures in the low 70s an absolutely gorgeous stretch ahead over the next three days or so. And let's take a look at your seven day here. We're Friday looking like kind of the pick of the next three days. Beautiful sunshine across the area. We may even see some spots uh, reach the mid to upper 70s by the afternoon. So really can't ask for a better oh, end to the work week this week. Love it. All right. Thank you, Katie. And stories working on new tonight. Coming up on 12 News at 4, Providence Mayor Red Smiley will join us.